Hey, greetings and welcome everyone. My name is Chris. Uh, thanks for joining. Uh, I was going to start off with a, a video on how my dog can count to three, but I think that's kind of a bold statement and there's no way that I can actually prove that. But in the process of demonstrating what, what I was going for, uh, I was able to record him doing some of the basic tricks that we taught him as a young puppy and he's 11 years old now, so he still, he still remembers them. And, uh, and, I, and I wanted to share them with you. So he's a doxy poo, which means he's half poodle, half dachshund. And the poodle breeds is, uh, well, from what I've read, the second, I don't know how they measure this, the second most intelligent uh, breed right after the border collie. Right? So the, uh, the poodle's supposed to be a, a real smart dog. Uh, my guy, um, he, he, so he's 50% poodle, 50% dachshund. I think dachshunds are more, maybe a little bit more stubborn. Um, as they're bred to, uh, to hunt badgers, right? So I don't know, the brains are at the, smarts are at the top of the list for needing to hunt a badger. But, um, but Maximus does know some tricks, and I'm pretty proud, actually. So you'll see three in this video that he's able to, uh, that he's able to pull off, and, and, and so two of them may be obvious, and one is not so obvious, but we'll, we'll wrap up and review uh, what those tricks were. So thanks for watching. Uh, let's check out Maximus doing some of his tricks. Can you stay, Maximus? Stay. Stay. All right, let's see if Maximus knows how to count up to three. Okay, well, he's already come. Come here. Okay, can you sit? Can you lay down? Good boy, stay. Stay. Stay, Maximus. You're a good boy, huh? You're waiting, aren't you? <laughs> okay, sit, sit. Lay down. Good boy. Can you stay? Stay. You're a good boy, huh? Okay, come over here. Come over here. Okay, sit. Lay down. Good boy. Lay down. Good boy. You stay. Oh, lay down. Good boy. Stay. That's it. Good boy. Okay, so there was uh, there was three tricks, and two of them were obvious, and maybe the third one's obvious too. But obviously, he knows how to sit. So when I say sit, he sits. Uh, I wonder if he's trying to sit right now. He knows how to lay down. So when I say lay, he lays down. He sometimes gets sometimes he jumps right into a lay position, just anticipating that I'm going to say it. Um, but when I say sit, he sits. When I say lay down, he lays down. And then the third is that if I put food on the floor and he knows that he's supposed to wait, um, he'll wait, right? So he could, he, and I've, uh, I've left the room. I've tested this out before. I've told him to sit and wait and put some food that he, he's desperate to eat uh, right in front of him. And he sits there and he's very obedient. He's, he's very, uh, he's a good dog, right? He's, he was trained at a pretty early age. Those, that, that's about all the tricks he knows. Um, I will say he's pretty stubborn when sometimes I'll take him to parks and he's off leash and I, and I can't just call him and he'll come running, especially when he's in his smell mode, right? When he's out smelling things, I have to physically go and get him and grab him. Um, so I will say he has his own stubborn streak when it comes to being off leash at parks and other places where he's wanting to smell things, but otherwise he's pretty good. And I will say when, um, you know, I've, I've left the park sometimes just to go sit in my car and, and he, he, he becomes aware, he knows I'm missing, and then he's pretty good at tracking his way back to the car. So, But he's 11, so he's, he's no slouch when it comes to uh, finding his way around. But anyway, thanks for, thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you'd like to see more Maximus. And uh, yeah, as always, hope you're doing well. Stay safe, and we'll see you next time.